Hi guys, so I'm here with Laura and I'm going to be getting Laura listed. Um, this Laura was originally a custom order um, who has now become available. So her painting style is what was requested by the customer who had ordered her, which is a bit different than my normal babies. And I'll show you details in a second. Um, but Laura has a magnet for a pacifier. And she does come with her COA and stuff from Bonnie. And uh, this kit is just the regular open edition kit. And this Laura is filled with Plastisol, which I've talked about in other videos. But Plastisol is a polyvinyl material that feels like silicone. Um, so it is a bit heavier and it is very, very squishy. Um, so she, you know, jiggles a little bit better. Um, she is heavier. Um, she is seven pounds and six ounces, I believe. Um, she had requested a couple of things. Uh, she wanted heavy purple on the eyelids and pretty dark lips. Um, so you could see that is different than my regular babies. She also wanted a more subtle skin texture and a cleaner complexion. Um, so her modeling and stuff is a lot lighter. Um, her biggest request was very, very, very thick hair. Um, so you could probably see this Laura is rooted very thickly. Um, she's rooted with, um, sorry, I'm drawing a blank. Uh, I can't remember what mohair, it might be Sarah Silk. I cannot remember what mohair right now for some reason. Um, but it is premium mohair. Um, and it's, you know, rooted thickly. It's very soft, nice and shiny it looks like on here. Um, it's nice hair, although I know super thick hair is not something I normally do, and I know it's not everybody's uh, preference. Um, her body is filled with Plastisol inserts that I made, which, again, feels like silicone inserts, and angel silk, and a little bit of glass beads behind the inserts just for some extra weight. She's nice and heavy. Um nice and floppy and let me go ahead and I'll bring you in for some details here all right so Laura has uh, painted brows that ha do have a little bit of texture strands but it's more subtle um, she has capillaries rooted lashes More subtle blushing. Uh, she doesn't have any blemishes. She does have a bit of skin texture, but it is not like my normal super heavy skin texture. And she does have modeling and veining, but it's just a lot more subtle. Um, I actually really like her nails. If I could get those to focus, they came out really well. And she does have rings for extra stability and easy turning, which is always a good idea for plastisol filled dolls just because it stresses the joints a little bit more on the body because of the extra weight. And again, uh, you know, light, very, very light texture. She feels pretty smooth and soft and more subtle modeling. Um, her toenails are done. Hopefully you guys can see that. And normal blushing on the bottom of her feet. And again, you know, I don't recommend doing this a bunch because uh, it could potentially, you know, crack paint. But she is so, so squishy. You know, this kit has a really soft vinyl anyways. Um, so it worked really, really well with the Plastisol. She feels, she could definitely feel like a firmer um, silicone than a regular vinyl kit. But everything is squishier. 
But yeah, that is Laura. Um, she's going to be listed on my website and I'll probably put her on Etsy too, but I'll put the links in the description and I will see you guys next time.